source code for these applications are attached in lesson 4 of this Java course. Comments in Java This double slash notation, at the beginning of the line, defines comments where you can write almost anything. These comments are not executed by the computer. They are only for humans to explain and remember what the code is doing. Name your package using country, company, project. This line is the first Java code line and uniquely defines the postal address of this class. Import Java libraries to reuse the code that was written by the great army of Java programmers. JFrame works like the main application window where components like labels, buttons, text fields are added to create a graphical user interface, GUI. The graphics class allow an application to draw objects on a virtual canvas. Graphics 2D class extends the graphics class to provide more sophisticated control over geometry, coordinate transformations, color management, and text layout. This is the fundamental class for rendering two-dimensional shapes, text and images on the Java, TM platform. The color class is used to encapsulate colors in sRGB or other color space standards. Java is a high-level object-oriented programming language. Its main object definition is done using the word class. If somebody else defined a class with the same name, then you can distinguish between them using the package name. The unique class name is RO. Videndi. Lessons. Approximate underscore circle underscore with underscore lines. The extends JFrame is the only complicated stuff in this file, belonging to object-oriented programming. Here is where we inherit a previously defined object, class. JFrame is a standard Java object used for user interfaces. Here, we will draw our lines and circles in a JFrame. We will draw our objects inside a squared canvas of size 900. We defined here our first function. Functions are meant to eliminate duplicate code and to encapsulate and test functionalities. Use this function to get the value of canvas width. Get the height of the canvas. This is the class constructor. It is an important tool of Java that you will find in almost every class. You can recognize constructors as they have the same name as the class. Constructors are called at the initialization of objects and can call constructors of inherited objects. Initialize object variables. Execute some class procedures. Set title is a property of JFrame, and we define here the frame title that will be shown to the user. Set size directs Java to create a 1000x1000 pixels window for us to draw circles in. Set visible is a tricky instruction that shows the frame to the user. Its side effect is calling the paint function where we will deliberately write our drawing code. Exit underscore on underscore close is an instruction to the Java Windows system that our frame is the main frame. And we want to close the application when the user close this frame. This is the main procedure that is called by Java to refresh the user interface. This is a tricky instruction that creates a second main graphic engine, just a link. Graphics 2D is a better drawing engine, and we secretly suppose that we received a link to it. This instruction will fail on old Java systems. When we know exactly how many times you want to loop through a block of code, we use for loop. Color each circle approximation with a different color. Draw one circle approximation with line segments. Use a prime number for better rainbow results. Only one part of a switch block will be executed, as specified at runtime by its selector value. 
choose the standard colors from the Java color library. Do not forget the break instruction that terminates a switch block of code. Light blue defined using its RGB values. Light green defined using its RGB values. Dark green defined using its RGB values. If no block was executed then the default block of code is executed. NR underscore steps is the precision used to approximate the circle, equal with the number of line segments. Compute the radius of a circle that will fit inside the canvas. We place the center of our drawing axes in the middle of the canvas. Compute the radius asterisk radius value to be used in the formula below. Compute the value of the step, used to walk on the aux axis. Initialize starting point of the lines we are going to draw. Initialize ending point. First we need to compute the starting point of the first line. We start the drawing process from the right side of the aux axis. Loop, nr underscore steps plus 1, times. Compute the first point of the first line, start with the x coordinate. Compute the y coordinate of the first point. Do not enter this block of instructions anymore. Start anew for cycle. Compute the second point of the line, start with the x coordinate. Compute the y coordinate of the end point of the line. Draw the line that approximate a part of the circle. Mirror the line on the other part of the aux ax. Save the end point as the start point. Start with the x coordinate. Save the y coordinate as the first point of the next line. This is the main Java program, named also main, that is usually the first executed procedure. If you do not define other starting point and Java uniquely finds this procedure. It will be executed at program start. We call the function print lane from the package system dot out and the result is a feedback line in application console. Program is up and running. This is a tricky instruction where from the static function main, we start to define a dynamically created object, circles. As a side effect, the object approximate underscore circle underscore with underscore lines draw lines and circles in the user interface. Things could be done much simpler here, but you must get used with object creation and the transfer from the static procedures to a chain of objects that start to execute their procedures. New creates a new object of the class that we defined in this Java code file. As a side effect, it will call the constructor of this class. One of the instructions in the constructor sets the JFrame as visible to the user. As a side effect, the visibility calls the paint function. As a side effect of object-oriented programming, the at override instruction that we defined for paint in this file will replace the standard paint function with our function and call it. Our paint function will draw circles as instructed in this file. In the next lesson, we will draw a spiral of color-filled circles and even 3D objects. If you receive this feedback, end. In the console and no drawing, there is a JFrame error. Programmer job includes a lot of debugging of code, so you need to add this kind of feedback lines in your programs. If you have questions, please send them to software at videndi.com. Source code for these applications are attached in lesson 4 of this Java course.